Welcome back. Dunkaroos. A Dunkaroo is essentially a little graham cracker, graham cookie that you dunk into frosting. You want it to be like a birthday cake out of the box tasting frosting. We're gonna use three different sprinkles in this, so. This is my favorite shade. I'm sure you can see it. Honestly, I don't know what's wrong with me. So I'm gonna start with an unsalted butter. It's going to be very yellow because it's high in fat. We're not making Dunkaroos to be healthy. Oh my god, ew. Ugh. Oh. So I'm gonna take this bad boy and I'm gonna put one stick of softened butter. Why would I fling a, a knife around like that? I'm also gonna take about two ounces of cream cheese. Wow, that's beautiful. That is beautiful. Oh. Do a little plop a do like that. So I'm gonna add a good scoop. We're gonna go ahead and put this in the KitchenAid, get it mixed up. I wanna whip it. Sponsored by me because I bought all this. So, so Gumdrop, just so you know, if you put like sexual stuff and curse words in your videos. I'm not putting not anything sexual. If you're gonna hoe, you need to hoe for money. Yeah, that's a good point. Okay. I'm using clear vanilla extract. It's gonna keep this light in color and it also gives us that kind of fake dessert taste. I'm also gonna add some corn syrup. It's gonna add to the consistency. Oh no, what was that? Like a couple tablespoons? And again. I'm using a little bit of lemon for acidity, just a tiny bit. Confectioner sugar. So this is for making eggs, but I like it as a really big spatula. I know what you mean now, talking about it being sexual. Let us proclaim the mystery of faith. One cup whole wheat flour, two tablespoons dark brown sugar. I like sugar. I'm taking a teaspoon and like maybe a half. Sorry, my instructions suck. But anywho, a teaspoon of baking powder, three fourths a teaspoon of salt, some baking soda, some honey. What could be more beautiful? Now we're getting somewhere. So it's just holding together. Perfect. Quick, put it in the blast chiller. Cover it with some flour so it doesn't stick. A little softer. Like when you have a teddy gram and you leave the bag open for like a week and then you eat them, that's what it tastes like. Mmm, that's good. Mm. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, subscribe, hit the little bell notification, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, aww.